Hello and welcome to Bombay Talkies. The Bombay Marathon has just got bigger every year and this year it's going to be particularly extraordinary because of what the city has gone through. So it's going to be quite remarkable to see all those thousands of people coming together. It's, it's going to have the kind of symbolic value that perhaps no other marathon has gotten. Uh, joining us is a very special group of people uh, who are here and, and, and going to be part of it. Gail Devers, who's a world Olympic champion, just fantastic to have you here. Oh, Thanks, thank you. Uh, I'm honored to be here. So much for being here. You're going to be part of the marathon. Also, John Abraham, who apparently is uh, going to be competing with Gail. That's what he was telling me. Yeah. Just before he started. <laughs> he's, he's getting All the very best, excited yeah. <laughs> to do that. Also, John Keelai, who's uh, someone who's another world-class marathon runner. He won the marathon the last time around from Kenya. Thank you so much. Thank you so uh, much. For being back here. And, of course, uh, Anil Singh, the man who makes it happen year after year, uh, also joins us. Terrific uh, to have all of you here. John, fantastic to have Gail, isn't it? It's, it's, it's I mean, especially actually. on a year like this, it's, it's just great. To yeah, have it's, it's totally surreal. I mean, for someone who's grown up on the Olympics, watching her, uh, it's, I mean, I'm tongue-tied. She's sitting <laughs> next to me. And for anybody who's grown up watching the Olympics, uh, Gail Devers is, is God. Yeah. She's a goddess. A goddess. So, <laughs> yeah, a goddess, you know. So is, is it's it? a pleasure having you. Thank yeah, you. It's, no, it's awesome. Thank you. Does yeah. that speak for how old I am? <laughs> no. <laughs> no, not at all. no, this, is, this yeah. is great. It's an honor for me to be here and to be a part of this. You know, I always say things happen in life for a reason. Mm -hmm. So there's a reason why I'm here at this particular spot this particular time in life with all that's happened in India, all my life, the adversities that I've gone through. Yes. It's for a reason to just, we all have to keep the faith. First time here in India? It's my first time, but it will not be my last. It will not be my last. I, I have adopted, officially adopted India as wow, my new country. Oh, wow, I'm dead serious. Great, I, I, You've only been here, what, like two days? A couple days, like... that's all it took. I mean, I, to be honest, when I landed off the plane and walking through the airport uh, to get into the car, it was something about the people. And I'm, I'm one of these people where I, I'm really in tune with right. and the people, the warm reception. It was something that it, it just exuded hospi hospitality. So. It could have been Anil Singh. <laughs> yeah. It could have been. It could have been <laughs> him too. And I, but it was, a, it was a warmth. And I tell people yeah. it wasn't because of the weather. It was a warmth that I felt that just made you feel like you're welcome and you're supposed to be here. No, no, it's, it's fantastic. As you said, at a time like this, uh, yeah. Was it? How did you swing this? How? Was this, was this difficult? I, I, I sort of pleaded. I was on my knees. <laughs> I was on my knees to get here. Yeah, we need you. Come on. <laughs> it, uh, no, she was wonderful. I mean, you know, it was just wonderful to have us say yes because we were a little. There were a little apprehensions in the, about what happened here, yeah, but said you know everything is wonderful. Hmm. Mumbai is fine. Everybody is safe, and you know we'll make sure you're comfortable hmm. and you'll be looked after well. So she was very kind to say yes. But tell me, you, uh, you said apprehensions. Uh, that's not really stopped the number of people wanting to take part. You're telling me that it's, it's, it's as big as last year. Actually, it's bigger. It's, it's, uh, it's, uh, forget about, uh, it, forget apprehension. I think what's happened, uh, to refer to 2611, has actually created more resolve. It's created yeah, more, more people want to come and it's more people been, want the, to take the part. The enthusiasm, the ethos, the feel, the, the entire... It's amazing to see that kind of energy, hmm. and everybody wants to do something productive vis-a-vis right. -vis the Santa Charter and Mumbai Marathon. They yes. all want to be a part of it. Yeah. And I've also heard rumors that we're going to have more than the normal 200,000 people that line the, 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 the roads that are to cheer the athletes on. I believe they're trying to go to hit half a million marks. I just, I'm, just, I'm just so delighted. It's been fantastic. And even on grounds of charity, 